New York Governor Kathy Hochul signed a pair of bills into law this week to address chronic issues with emergency services across the state. Our Plattsburgh Bureau Chief Alec Lasham explains what the changes are and what it means for emergency health care. New laws are on the books and the Empire State that tackles costs for emergency medical services, as well as expands what emergency medical technicians can do. North Country Democratic Assemblyman Billy Jones says he hopes the new laws will alleviate financial burdens for EMS, EMTs, and patients across the North Country. We're hoping that this will help them, um, that they can get reimbursed for this, that will help them so that they can provide uh, the level of service that you know, our residents need. Jones says EMS will now be reimbursed by Medicaid for treating in place visits, which is when an ambulance goes anywhere other than a hospital for care. However, in Champlain, EMS has been billing patients for their in home visits. Champlain Moore's EMS Captain Corey Thompson says that accounts for roughly 20% of calls. Right now, when we charge those patients, they a lot of times they pay out of pocket. But now, he says the new law will make it so that his department gets reimbursed for its medical responses. Knowing that they could call uh, the local rescue squad at any time and get the help that they need and not really have to worry about what is this going to cost me uh, is certainly a benefit to, to, the, to our citizens. Another component of the new laws includes what type of care EMTs can administer. Our EMS providers um, can carry blood and can do blood transfusions. If someone needed to be transferred from our local hospital at CVPH over to, say, Albany or Syracuse or uh, Burlington, um, this would allow um, you know, blood transfusions to be happening on those on those transports. Republican State Senator Dan Sachs said in a statement, signing this bill into law will go a long way into improving our region's health care for both patients and caregivers alike. Reporting in Champlain, Alec Lasham, Channel 3 News.